Hey friends and welcome back to the gentleman's journey. In this one we're going to be putting some brass grommets on my giver gloves. Now friends I did a full review on these over just about a year ago and I love them. They're my go-to gloves. I also have their winter gloves which are lined. I think giver you know being an American company up in Wyoming has just an awesome brand going on there. Can't speak highly enough of them. Again it's not a review. Check back the video for that. Let me tell you guys kind of what tools we're going to need. Now friends, I'm already into leather, so I have some of my hatchet sheaths and my boys axe sheaths here that I made. So I have a bunch of these tools, but I'm going to drop a link in the description for the grommets and just a couple of tools that you'll need. The first thing, you know, that you really, really can't do without is the setter. So we'll show you how this works. Uh, and you want to smack it if you can with like a rubber or wood. This is a rawhide mallet because as you start smacking metal tools with a metal hammer, you're gonna mushroom over the top. Again, it'll get the job done, especially if you're just doing one set of gloves. Maybe don't run out and buy a new hammer just for that. Just be warned if you're doing it all the time, you're gonna be mushrooming over your tool. This is the 3 8 It's the number 14 by Tandy Leather Craft Tool Hole Punch. This is an awesome piece of kit here. If you guys get maybe the one that I drop in the description or something, it'll have all that. Again, because I'm into leather, I have this stuff already, but they make kits that have the setter and the hole punch, maybe for like 12 bucks or something. They're super cheap. Then of course you're gonna need the brass grommets. I do have some uh, metal ones. I think they're nickel plated. I've done a banner or something with these. I'm gonna go for the brass just cause I think it's a better look. And it is, I did buy the solid brass just for this product. The next thing is just finding out where you want the grommet to be. So I'm gonna put mine so that when I put my gloves, I can kind of use it even to pull the glove on a bit. And when I get done, I kind of want them hanging together. So that's the direction I'm gonna go with it. Let's get into punching a hole. All right, so I found this spot. Very simple guys, we're not doing, again, if you wanna line it up, you can kind of imagine where it's gonna be uh, at any rate. This is not rocket science. We're just popping a hole in there. I have a kind of a plastic wood and then some leather to pound into. A piece of wood on its own would be fine. All right, so there we have the hole. Now we're gonna feed this through. I kind of want the good smooth side in the glove so that my hand gets the nice smooth side. Feed that through. Now we're gonna want this hard surface and this is where the setter comes into play. Put the setter down, put that through. Now this guy here, make sure that's right side up. So now we're going to be uh, beveling this over, basically mushrooming that down. Again, again, I grab that hammer there and this is almost done. Set that aside. Just gonna run through the other one real quick. This is not a big deal, guys. Really easy little project that anybody can do. All right, got our hole through there. And slip this guy through. Grab the other one. All right, now we're gonna flatten that down. Guys, I'm so excited. Check out how this looks. Really excited about that. Let me kind of show you what I'm gonna end up doing with mine. So this is one of the occasions I'll be using mine for. Guys, probably just grab my gloves and clip it on there. You know, that's kind of one of the ways I'll have my gloves with me all the time. At any rate, just a fun little project. Super simple, guys. Again, check out my video on the giver gloves. Loving the heck out of these things. I think I'll throw some conditioner on them and that brass really just pops. Awesome little project. Hope you guys are enjoying all the videos over here at The Gentleman's Journey. Always looking to know what you guys wanna see next. Got some fun stuff planned. 
a bunch more boots, all kinds of stuff like that. So guys, until the next video, God bless. And hey, don't forget to give those boots or those gloves some love from time to time.